All right guys, what's up? So today we're actually somewhere you probably recognize if you've been following my videos very closely. And I'm actually Travis's and we're checking out his truck. I haven't been here in probably two weeks or so, maybe a little more, I don't know. But Travis has got a lot done since then. And me and Sean are actually down here to kind of help out. We're actually hopefully gonna get the cab off it. And you guys can actually see what's been going on. I'm just staring at this and it's just like, it's sad, but it's coming back. So I'll show you guys what we got going on so far. So yeah, you can just kind of take that in. New stuff. I was figuring we just like, yeah. Must have been satisfying to cut the roof off. Oh, you left your little. like half inch. And while we're fixing this, which we haven't even talked about yet, is we're fixing the cab, and we're also upgrading the truck at the same time. With are you doing transfer and trans? Transfer, trans, so what's in it now, what are you going to? That's the Granny 4 trans, but the transfer is only a single speed. But, and then I have a Granny tranny, but it's divorce setup. So it's got a U-joint on the back. Oh, okay. And then I think it's an NP... Was it 205? No, 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 never mind, no, it's a, it's a Dana 24 transfer. Okay. Is that like a 69 F250? Okay, gotcha. And then we're going from, going from the cask Really bad manifold that's just junk. You don't even want to look at it. Yeah, cracked and leaks and garbage to a nice hooker long tube, baby. You can see it right there. So that should be nice. And then we got to cut the rest of this up. We might. You think it'll actually cut all the way? Th no, nah, I don't think it'll cut the back off. Yeah, it'll probably just cut along the floor and then just break it up into a bunch of little pieces so it's easier to actually like take off because it's still a bit lighter. But uh, yeah, so. I'm gonna get cutting stuff. You can look at my vent, there's a whole bunch of leaves in there. Your vent? Yeah. Oh yeah, that happened with mine. Man, someone's like legit spray painted this thing like a bright green. It's white, it's bright green. Here's the original, amazing Kylan green. Like your other truck right there. Yeah, I yeah. love this green. Yeah, there it is right there. You better paint it, repaint it Highland. Yeah, there it is again. There's the good section of it. That's the original freaking paint. Isn't that an amazing color? I love that color. Don't great. you miss your truck? Yeah, I miss my truck. And then there's a the gas door. tank, doors, core support, fender wells, rear window. Oh my God. Going straight to town, let's do it. Yeah, no, you don't even have to do the blip blip words. I didn't even look at this earlier. He split the hood, split the spot welds on the hood right up and then mashed it up. And the steering column's out, roof is off, as you can see. That thing's all trashed. All sorts of trashed. And then everything else in there is all. There's parts in there. Yeah, it's kind of in there. Do you have a train horn? Yeah. No, 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 it's a Uga. Oh, it's an Uga horn. And we got a new door and then the old door. This thing is showed you guys this already once, but yeah, it's it's nasty. Alright, commence the cutting. That thing's pretty sweet. It is. I forgot how much I paid for it. Alright, so actually now that I'm down here, I actually make a very good point with the whole five speed BS going on. So he actually adjusted his clutch and it works very well. And I can actually put my hand in here and move it. Yeah, there you go. You can actually see how everything moves. It's pretty sweet. And that's what it looks like when it's nice and adjusted properly. It works. So, we are stripping the cab, so I do have to take this little cotter pin out, if I can get it out. Um, and then we can go ahead and take this rod off and then cut everything around, make sure all this stuff's disconnected from the engine and a bunch of this other stuff. They're gonna start cutting from the floor. That my oil pressure gauge is like destroyed, but it works. It, oh, you just watched the little thing turn? Yeah. <laughs> hey. the, the short side is the actual side that reads, and then like all the outside like white trim is like cracked down, and the glass is like falling in. And... <laughs> but it works. Uh, but it works. There's one on that truck too. I might figure out which one works better. That's funny. So 
satisfying. And it just falls. It's very entertaining. <laughs> oh, yeah. That isn't a bad cut, not gonna lie. Oh, nice. Seat belts and everything. Going your way. Okay, we're going my way. All right, you're going my way. So it doesn't catch stuff. See, I'm helping. <laughs> whoop, 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 whoop. Oh, oh, we're good. Okay, Sean didn't die for once. I think it's right now. Oh, dude, someone could have used those. No, actually, we're cutting the cab corners oh. out of it. Oh, oh, did you want those? Quarter! No, dude, those cab corners are always trashed. Actually, a little bit. I mean, granted, I saw a lot of Bondo, like, in example. So, you never know, it could just be full of Bondo. Is cab corners any good? Nah, I don't know about that. This one's, no. Nah. That's a little bit, that one's good, huh? Can't tell if it's metal or not, but whatever. It's probably better than someone's. All right, Inside. so we're gonna be cutting the cab again. Where are we? Where are we cutting it? Probably the bottom door hinge here, because then we can follow a straight shot around the bottom of the cab, and then the cab corner, I'm and then just, just yeah, go straight I'm across. Yeah, we're gonna try and follow the. And then yeah, because we're trying to be as I'm reasonable to save as we the can. Floor section the floor pan's the only thing worth that. money. Yeah. Yeah. So I mean, it's actually pretty nice too. Pretty so rust free. Try to keep that. All right, let's get cutting. It's literally, I was gonna say, I saw it and I'm pretty sure it was completely flat. Oh no, it's not even too bad. It's, it's pretty bad though. Yeah, yeah it's gone. Yeah. yeah, it's finessed. On to the next one. I told you we want leaves. Alright. We're gonna have to wait until the shifter. Alright. Oh. Oh. oh! Stop it! I don't like that flavor. Uh, you don't like that flavor? Stop doing that! Listen to that. Shift! Oh. Oh. Maybe like half, maybe? Half. You're like bigger than that? Hey, 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 the every size wrench. Oh, that's not going to fit anything. That's like almost my head. <laughs> Why did my Harbor Freight tool fail? I'm just taking one thing. Let's go with the Frame off restoration? This is a frame off. Wag, you're still filming. I know, I am still filming. On my 291. Alrighty, so. I did a live stream video on YouTube, or not YouTube. I did a live stream video probably about 20 minutes ago on Instagram, so I like doing those more. So if you want to follow my Instagram at the Craig909, I try to do stuff like that, I just keep forgetting. But uh, we did a live stream video of us taking the actual floor out of it, it was pretty cool. So, uh, Dash is out. Now we can go through that. I'm gonna see if I can actually snag this piece off of Travis. Travis, are you using your heater piece? The switching stuff, or are you using the one on that? Or does that even have one? Uh, I might swap them. Oh yeah? But I'll have one if I don't need one. Well, mine's, mine's all pitted. So whichever one you don't have, you don't need. That one's kinda nice, that one's just shinier. Oh, okay. But the lower, the lower arm will go through for me. Gotcha. Well, I can get one of those, but uh, yeah, we got the floor off, it's all in one piece, so now we got a decent floor pan that we can get rid of if anyone needs a floor pan. And you're in California, and you can come pick it up. Hey. So, this is all apart and power washed. Not really power washed, just lightly degreased, barely. Um, but yeah. I gotta come up with a power washer, I'll clean it off. Yep. Probably this. black the frame. Yeah, this is gonna be a lot of work to take this thing out. It's gonna suck, for sure. But, uh, looks promising with nothing on it. 
I mean, now it just looks like you're restoring something at this point. It doesn't look like anything was wrecked. Oh my god! Hi, buddy! It's Franklin! And he's not in his truck. <laughs> truck Franklin! Yeah, I traded his F100. Yeah, keeping it forward. Yeah, pretty much. Alright, guys, but uh, I'm gonna end the video here. This truck's getting somewhere, finally, which is cool. So we'll get the cab ready, put the cab on, new transmission. It'll be a whole new truck. Are you painting it? Yeah. Yeah. So, so it's gonna look nice. It might not, maybe I'm not playing great now. But, but yeah, eventually. Definitely. Eventually, it'll be pretty nice. So stay tuned for that. Like the video if you did enjoy it. Let me know what you do think down in the comments below. I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks so much for watching, bye. Oh, check out those blown shocks.